Jesus declared, Jesus Christ, not everyone who say to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only he who has the will of my Father who is in heaven. Remember, he declares, not everyone who say to me, Lord, Lord, they are saying, Lord, Lord. That means they are Christians. But he said, not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, but he who does the will, does the will of my Father who is in heaven. Many will say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did he not prophesy in your name and in your name drive out demons and perform many miracles? Many, many great creatures or pastors Perform the miracles for some time. No, no Christian is very pastor is a private program of the church. But sometimes later they they became corrupted. No, it's a it's a problem. At first, at first they they were very good Christians. Job, this is very good Christian. They could perform many miracles. But sometimes later they became corrupted. No, since this time they are not corrupted. What will happen to them? If what they are searching, basically, then I will tell them plainly: I never knew you. Away from me, you evil doers. No, to go to them is even as if they are not even known. My dear brothers and sisters. We Christians must live spiritual, spiritual. Okay? Do you agree with me? God is spirit. God is spirit. And we must worship Him in spirit and truth. God is spirit. And the eternal kingdom of heaven is a spirit world, not material world. And in the book of Thessalonians, chapter 5, verse 16 to 17, verse 5, chapter 5, verse 16 to 18. И в първо солнце от Петър Говал от Петър Говал от 16 до 18. Be only joyful. Бъдете винаги с радвите. Be only joyful. Винаги с радвите. Pray continue. Не представам се молете. Pray continue. Не представам се молете. Give thanks in all self-competence. Във всичко благодарете. How are you doing? Do you how how can you be only joyful? Even though very bad things are happening to you. And we uh, all of us know very well we must pray continuously. But many Christians do not pray a lot and deeply. That time they pray, but in most, in mostly they do not, do not pray continually. But the Bible says, be always joyful, pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances. In in other words, the Bible. It's commanding you very strongly. The catch is the crack of the Bible. The Bible is not strong. To live spiritual, the spiritual hope, spiritual. Okay. But as you can see, both creatures nowadays do not live spiritually. They are they 
They live according to their sinful nature. They live according to their sinful nature. You know the sinful nature. Most Christians, most Christians, are living following the sinful nature. But remember, heaven is purely spirit world. No, 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 Flesh according to the sinful nature. God does not punish you. God does not curse you. Basically. But after your physical death, you can regret eternally. After your physical death, you can be thrown outside into darkness. Forever. Not to be used by God in very, very dangerous. Okay. Not to be used by God in very, very dangerous. Not to be able to manifest the power and the gifts of the Holy Spirit is very, very dangerous. In heaven, you can be thrown outside into the darkness forever. And if you lose your faith, your faith, you can also go to So, from this time on, we must make every effort to be used God. To be used God. We must make every effort to be used God. And remember, only a spiritual person, spiritual person, only a spiritual person can be used. Why? Why? Only a spiritual person, not a fleshly person. Only a spiritual person who, who is doing his best to live spiritually. Only a spiritual person who is who is doing his best to be led by the Holy Spirit to be controlled by the Holy Spirit. God is Spirit, the Holy Spirit. And the heaven is purely Speak was not material. Only a spiritual person can be can be easily led by the Holy Spirit, can be easily controlled by the Holy Spirit. Only a spiritual person 
can add a very intimate fellowship with the Holy Spirit. Само това човек може да има близко взаимоотношение и взаимоотношение с Светлина. So, God really wants you to be a special person. So, how can you become a special person? Only a special person can have an intimate fellowship with the Holy Spirit. If so, how can you become a special person? We, we were born fleshly persons. How can you become a special person? By the Holy Spirit and by the Bible, by the Bible, by the Gospel. So this is a scary word, this is a mighty word. It's just speaking by the truth. So this is a mighty word. In a wide sense, by the word of God, by the Bible. So this is a mighty word, so this is a mighty word, so it's good for you. If you really want to. If you do your best to live being led by the Holy Spirit, being controlled by the Holy Spirit, being touched by the Holy Spirit, in, in all things, if you, if you make every effort to be touched, to be controlled, to be led by the Holy Spirit, you can become gradually a spiritual person.